fanatics rigging a little trout magnet action here you guys ready for some freaking bobber downs this is gonna be a bobber down baby head to head challenge i'm going the same technique but on a fly rod look at that so little, we're gonna see little little, little heads Ooh, Ooh. munchies so we're gonna see i'm gonna rig up my fly rod here and we're gonna see if the five method can be just as effective using a trout magnet as the bobber method so and it's gonna be just like it always is the gear fisherman's gonna outfish the fly fisherman yeah, right. because that just pretty much happens. I think this is gonna, time. I'm gonna be able to cast farther than you guys. There's gonna be something to that. You're not gonna be able to cast farther than me. Yeah. Why do you, what makes you think that? It's, well, we'll see. Okay. I'm not even gonna say anything. I'm gonna let my. Sometimes let my, when you forget your Gerber pliers, you use your Gerber scissors to cinch down the old split shot. It works. That split shot is probably honestly gonna sink this float, That's but. That's exactly it. That's what I was thinking. But we're gonna test it out and see. Oh, it's fighting hard, Sean. Sean, get the camera out of my face. I tell you this all the time. You haven't seen these yet. The old push button reel. Let's get it. Look what Clint just did. <laughs> that's good. Oh my gosh. Sean. <laughs> that's why I that's why I walked away from that spot. <laughs> this is how you want to jig it though. You really want to get that straight up and down vertical. Oh my god, I'm gonna get a fish on it, Sean. <laughs> Not a fish over the tree. <laughs> I told you it's that vertical action. It's the vertical action. And I didn't get my hook stuck in the limb. You just gotta be patient. You gotta be patient. Giant. Not even head, sh head shaking. Oh my gosh. Whoops. Can you make that sound? Yeah. Oh, that's a trophy. That is a trophy. You snagged? <laughs> How does that even happen? No, it's wrapped around his fin. Oh, look at that. He ate that trout magnet. It's all the way down his throat. Quit moving, dude. If you just stop moving, we'll let you go. If you keep moving, you're going to not, not love life as much. Oh, it's a bluegill. There you go. Oh, I got one. Ooh, bluegill. Pretty one. They are sure pretty. Here's a big one. I want to thank my mom, dad, you know, my sponsors, you know, for believing in me. You know? Oh, there's. Double. 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 Oh. Okay, who's is bigger? Dude, mine is way, Mine's bigger. way bigger. bro. No. You're not even gonna try? Oh, that was Oh. Well, instant winner, because he just threw his back. Typical wild fashion, but we got we gotta find the crappie. Like there was a lot of perch back there, but uh, we're gonna pick up shop and Trying to find some, but we had some pretty epic bobber downs. Caught, you know, 50, 60, you know, pretty good. Well, it's pretty apparent this is where the crappie are. We got a bass boat right there, a bass boat right there, a bass boat right there. The pros are here. That means we found the right spot. Oh, 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 how about that, Clint? Oh, yeah. That's a big one, dude. That, that's a big one. Winning. Hell yeah. That's a trophy crappie. You can tell by the way it is. <laughs> Look at that. They don't call me crappie killing, fly flicking, fastest man in the West for nothing. Beauty. Not the target. Trophy. That's in a really good one right here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Really nice one. The momentum's starting to shift out here. I actually went, I went to an actual fly too. 
Went to a little grub thing, more like something natural that's gonna be in here. That thing's pretty. Go on our way to a meal. Got him. <laughs> cool. Another little beauty. Look at that thing in the sunlight. So perfect. So tasty. I'm on them now, dude. I got them figured out. They're not really biting. They're eating it and swimming away with it. So let them eat it longer and then slowly, slowly whip them. <laughs> Just kicking ass, taking names. Ah, everybody. Another little eater. Starting to get a good little pile of them here. The limit is 10. I'm using a brown one. The limit 10 out here, so I'm gonna just try to catch everybody's limit really quick. Or at least enough for me, and we're gonna flay these little guys out. Then Marlon brought his camp chef and his big flat iron cast iron skillet. So we're gonna fry them up, do a little batter. Brought actually a couple cool little, cool little uh, textures to roll it in too. So stay tuned for that, but I'm gonna get a few more so that we actually got some, a good little pile of meat. Coming in, coming in to swoop. Oh, did the old swipe reel on it. Oh god. That looked like a smaller one. The old under over. Let's see, that looks nine inches. No, that one's pretty small, dude. I'd let that one go. Thank you, buddy. We want bigger ones than that. I must have just switched or something. <laughs> that one's a little more keepable. All right, we better keep track here. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six. Two, four, six. Yeah, four more. Four more, and then I can sit here and kick back and drink Coca Colas and make fun of these guys. Enjoy the sunset. Oh, you're under. Oh, Marlon's gonna get a fish for sure. You're under. Oh. I was watching Marlon. Mine ain't gonna. Mine's not gonna be able to get pulled under. Oh, I got one. <laughs> that one looks like everybody got. Aww. Oh, what a jumper. Oh, what a jumper. Beats him. Oh, just like that. Showing these boys how it's done out here. I don't think this one's of legal size. Don't get out of here. What'd you get? Oh, Clint, you dug him out of there. That's a crappie. Nice. Oh, it's a keeper. Let me see. Oh yeah, that's a good one, Clint. Got him. Oh, that's a big one. Oh yeah, you guys suck. <laughs> oh yeah, I gotta get the little weed. Oh yeah. Just raking them in over here, boys. What do you know about it? This is a fly fishery. That one's 100% on the stringer there. Three more to go, boys. 
Oh boys, I'm on fire. Oh yeah. Woo! Oh, that's a, it's an eater there. That's fish number eight, everybody. I'm almost to my limit. Yeah. Another nice one. Jig fell out. Flat fell out, I mean. All right, boys, one more and you're all toast. Oh, God, I got him. Hey, boys, number 10. He's up, down, and all around. What's going on here? Sweet. Here's fish number 10, everyone. These guys didn't even stand a chance. That's what got her done. Little green fly. Or brown, I can't tell I'm colorblind, but nevertheless, we got a limited crappie. Let's go cook them. All right, everyone, you've been waiting for it. I've been waiting for it as well. We're finally gonna unveil my new boat. I've been waiting for a long time. Shout out to Stevens Marine, introducing the new addicted boat of mine right now. Get it back in here. You're gonna lose it, dude. <laughs> Is it cutting out? Yeah. It's dude, it's my Mercury. My Mercury's already having issues, dude. It's cutting out. <laughs> Sorry, I don't have my nav lights on right now. Are you ready? <laughs> All right, guys, so we got Blue Heart. Hot chili pepper Takis. They're blue in color. I don't know why, but I was at the gas station and Marlon wanted to get something to put the fish in to fry up, so we decided to get blue Takis. So we're crushing. Out of all the other great options you could have been. Yeah, well, I mean, we're at like a talkies. gas station and like, <laughs> you know, so. And then I think we're gonna try some of this, a little bit of. We're gonna do a cook off. Pizza Pringles. We're gonna crush those up and see how that tastes fried up with some crappie. So hopefully this sticks to the fish. Clint at the store said we didn't need any eggs, so that's your fault if we needed eggs. Dip them in barbecue. Roll them in the takis. <laughs> Dude, pizza. You got some. All right, guys. So we've got the blue takis, and then we got some pizza Pringles. So we're gonna fry up some fish. Jordan's gonna fry up some fish. We got Chef Jordan over here. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> You're missing your apron though. Where's know, your addicted apron that it. I got for you? I got switched up out of my rig today. I had it already. Okay. All right, let's do it. Set them on down here. Let's yeah. just kind of, we'll go half and half. Which one do you think is gonna be the best? Uh, dude, seriously? The pizza. Oh, yeah. no, no, <laughs> Come on. A, this whoa, is pizza here. that one went right over my head. <laughs> I'm just gonna lay a even amount. That's what's nice, but luckily, you know, I caught a whole limit. Uh, but, you know, normally you need probably about five or six per person to, to get even a table's, table's worth of, of a meal there for everybody, so. I'm gonna lay all these in here. I'm just gonna give them a little shake on that side. Ooh. Flip them all over. Tasty. Yeah, and we're not seasoning these at all because there's obviously a lot of salt and stuff already on these, on these uh, Pringles, and especially the Takis. They're really spicy. Got a lot of seasoning on them. Ooh, that's a cool color. Like a blue ring. Ooh, wow. Look at that. Doctor, that's Doctor Seuss crappie. We're gonna have to start using these Takis as a brine for our, our herring or something. <laughs> Why not? We got a spatula? No, it's all, all by hand. Your hand. We have no spatula. You can use a plate. You can use oh, a plate. Yeah, I don't a work. plate. Uh, you can use the scrubber <laughs> yeah, knife. This, work. this knife will work. It's big. That's what I was gonna say. It's not gonna stay on there. 
They're only gonna cook for three seconds anyway. It's like no oil. Well, it's a, guys are beans it's a crowd no, favorite. No, it's, it's very, not. It's come very, smell this come over here. Come take a whip. It's very like, go take a big breath. Inhale. It smells like burnt tortilla. Kind of Dude, he's burnt. What do you want me to do? Here, let's just do this. Oh, there we go. For yeah. sure. Now nah, we're talking, boys. Ew, ew, ew. Now you need oh, you got a knife. Oh, that's going good. Look at how blue those turn. Those are that is <laughs> crazy how blue they turn. <laughs> That's a trip. Is the knife going to work the flip or do you want to? Oh, yeah. Okay. Mm. 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 Dude, that smoke did. Yeah. That's nice. Something. Wouldn't you say? Yeah, it's clear, I'd say nice. clearly not done in the middle, though. Nice. <laughs> I'm getting worms. <laughs> there you go. Try those boys. Put some of that oil drain off of them there. You tried the blue one yet? Yeah, it's really good. It's nice. How is it, Jordan? It's good. Just the meat itself is good. You know, we kind of, we're just using the breading as fun, but just that coffee meat in general. Yeah. Like you said before, it's got just that nice, like mild little walleye taste. Not quite as fishy as say like a, a lingcod or a, a rockfish, but still light and fresh kind of tasting. No, give it a try. The blue actually is good. <coughs> it's hot. It's good. The, the pizza one is better. That's amazing. You can't really taste the pizza though. It's got like, it's different though than that blue one. It's got enough. Yeah, it doesn't taste like got some pizza. But, to it. Yeah. No, Marlon's out. Marco. He's like, not even gonna try to make it like believable. Right, judging by that means I'm not even gonna try it. <laughs> not yet. Wasn't that good, folks? Yeah, these guys. Whose idea was Just this? hungry or something. <laughs> okay, it was mine. I showed up. You handed it to me. I know. I I... Marlon, call. Okay, one thing you're never I... gonna get it addicted, everyone, is we're never gonna lie to you. Some of these other guys, <laughs> they're putting on a show. We are not. This is real life, everyday action. And I really like the pizza. And yeah, some people like it. I just, it, the consistency, it didn't have a bad taste, but once I started the, chewing yeah, into it, the consistency was really weird to me. It tasted like That's why I said that's they got mushy. Mush. Mush. Well, it got yeah. mushy. Yeah. 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 Yeah, that's didn't... why you heavy bread them and you put them into a taco. <laughs> yes. Well, I think too, it didn't cook, it's not cooking fast enough too. Well, and it's we like didn't slowly, cool it's, really it's getting, it's yeah. getting like soaked up by the grease. Well, nice for the record way. addicts, this wasn't my recipe idea. We we'll give this one to Mike. It was, Mike and Clint. No, I just drove. We got we got the phone call I from drove. Marlon. Hey, I'm running late, and you guys stop and get some stuff. And so they and stopped and literally got some stuff. And I said, "Come up with a good idea." <laughs> this was a great idea, and it wasn't it a bad didn't... idea. All right, everybody. Well, we appreciate you having a fun, goofy day with us out here. Nobody knew coming into this. Not even really. I was kind of getting cocky with the fly fishing because I accidentally catch these, but dominated so Dude, i feel pretty good about yeah, like that. that little fall or something by yeah that i think you were person. right you called it too because that's what, the last time I, that will ever happen as soon as i started <laughs> moving it and stripping it i started catching them almost every time so i hope you guys enjoyed this don't try this recipe at all it's not that good <laughs> but, <laughs> but we're going to expand on it yeah, we're going to try but, some other things but we'll we got potential potential round two coming. yeah if you had fun today be sure to comment below be sure to drop a thumbs up if you guys want to see more videos yeah. just like this one go over here and click this link to the next video go down hit subscribe turn your bell on and comment below and you can be the comment of the day just like this one right here thank you so much you guys you stay fishy and we'll see you out there